Next to the 4A final, Ron Colley looking to win its first state title in four years as they went up against Hobart, making its first trip to the finale since 1996. Ron Colley gets on the board with three minutes to play in the first. Aiden Leffler spots Michael Gallagher in the flat. He scores from five yards out. They're up by 14 after the opening quarter. More from the Rebels in the second. Leffler over the middle to Cole Beckman, who stays with it and cruises in for the 50-yard touch. Rebels on a roll, now up by 21. Then with 22 seconds left in the half, Ron Kelly doing it again. Leffler with his fourth touchdown pass. Kyle Lockhart brings this one in to give the Rebels a 28-point lead as they go into the locker room. Ron Colley not wasting any time in the third, and they're opening up the playbook on the first play of the second half. The flea flicker, Leffler with a bomb to Lockhart. He goes in for the 50-yard score. His three TD grabs ties a 4A state record in a title game. The Rebels going into the fourth, leading by 42. Hobart would punch it in late in the game with this two-yard score from Tyler Turley. Ricky's down though, 42 to seven. Then on the ensuing kickoff, Dominic Brown on the return for Ron Kelly, and he has reservations for six. <laughs> 92 yards to the crib. Ron Kelly rolls 49 to seven is the final. It's the Rebels' first state title in four years and 10th overall, which is the fourth highest total in Indiana history.